Hi, in this chapter we will compare a list and a map for searching an item inside these collections. Let's say we put all of our items into an array list and here is the item that we are searching for. And then we put all these items into a hash map and this is the item that we are searching for. Let's say we are trying to find this item. For this, you need to iterate over all the items of the array. So you will test if the first item is the item you are searching for, then for the second, then for the third, and so on and so on. And you will test all the items just to find this one single item. So, search time inside the list depends on the size of the array list or the list. Okay. But inside the map, search time is constant if the hash key distributes all the keys uniformly. Regardless of the size of the hash map, the search time for an item is constant. So you will find this item in a constant time, regardless of the size. Let me demonstrate it in Eclipse. Let me create a class search comparison list versus map i will create thousands of customer instances and will put into both array and map and then we will search for an item an exact item and we'll see the execution times first let me create a list okay it will store customers inside the inheritance package and it is customer list and the concrete implementation is array list okay then we will create a map and it will store customer instances okay say customer map and the concrete implementation is hash map okay now inside the for loop i will create thousands of customers and will put into both list and map now let's say for int i equals to zero till i is smaller than nine hundred thousands okay let me create a customer c and say new customer new customer ID will be I to simulate a discrete ID and name will be Talha plus I so we will concatenate uh, this number to Talha to discriminate the instances and say Ojakji plus I gender is male is licensed is false And we will put this into both list and map. So let's say customer list dot add C and the map classes. The first item is integer. It will be customer's ID and this will be the real customer. Okay, so I will put customer map put the ID of the customer because we will search with IDs, okay? Then the customer itself. Now let's first search on customer lists. We will use customer list dot index of, okay? And we will create the object we are searching for. Its ID is this name and surname is this. That's one of the items we have been created here. So we are searching for this item, the last item inside the array. And I'm passing this as the parameter searched. And, and before and after the invocation of this method, I will get the time. Get time and the same thing here time 2 and I will print out the time difference here time 
2 minus time 1 and I'm saying this search time equals to this and now I will do the same thing for the maps for this I will get the new date here and time to here I will search for this object inside the customer map get searched okay now I will print out the second time it is map search time and now let's try it you see this search time is 25 milliseconds and map search time is 0 milliseconds what if I increase the counts like this let's try it you see list search time is 145 milliseconds map is again about zero so map is so much faster than the list this is the demonstration of it see you in the next chapters